Firing in three, two, one. University of Missouri engineers have developed a method of creating and controlling plasma that could revolutionize American energy generation and storage. The MU researchers have developed a device that launches a ring of plasma as far as two feet. They say this is the first time U.S. scientists have succeeded in creating a self-sustaining ring of plasma in atmosphere without the use of powerful electromagnets. This is the holy grail of plasmas. We've been able to generate a self-stabilized, self-confined plasma that will propagate in open atmospheric air without any magnetic fields. It opens up a lot of new possibilities and one of them is generation of energy and the other one is storage of energy. We've been able to not only generate the plasma in air but it stays together for tens of milliseconds at a few kilojoules Okay, which is almost unheard of. It's almost like ball lightning. Not quite like ball lightning, but maybe a forerunner to ball lightning. Plasma does not emit radiation and is completely safe for humans in the same room, despite being incredibly hot. Plasma is the fourth state of matter, and our sun that provides energy to us every day operates in a plasma state. It's at about 6,000 degrees K. The plasma we are launching vary somewhere between 6,600 degrees K and 7,700 degrees K depending on how much energy we put into it. Thus the plasma that we're launching is actually hotter than the Sun. Curry believes he could make his device considerably smaller yet able to handle even larger amounts of energy. He says that future funding of this and other important projects is vital for the U.S. to compete in the future of energy technology. This research was funded by the Office of Naval Research and MU. For the MU News Bureau, I'm Nathan Hurst.